Imagine a world where the moon isn't just a celestial body shining brightly in our night sky, but a thriving hub of life and growth. But before we get too far ahead of ourselves, there's a rather significant hurdle to clear. How do we grow food on the lunar surface? A group of innovative agronomists and biotechnicians at China Agricultural University has been tackling this question head on. Their approach? They're not trying to transport soil from Earth to the moon, but rather, making the moon soil fertile for plant growth. Their method is as ingenious as it is simple. They began by replicating lunar soil using volcanic material right here on Earth. Into this simulated lunar regolith, they introduced three types of bacteria, Pseudomonas fluorescens, Bacillus megaterium, and Bacillus mucilaginosus. Once these bacteria set up shop in the soil samples, the researchers watched and waited. What they found was fascinating. The presence of the bacteria made the soil samples more acidic, which in turn reduced the pH level of the soil. This acidity broke down the phosphate-containing minerals in the soil, releasing phosphorus, a key nutrient that plants need to grow. But the proof, as they say, is in the pudding. So, the research team planted Nicotiana benthamiana, a type of tobacco plant, in the treated soil. The results were impressive. The plants grown in the enhanced soil had more robust roots, longer stems, and bigger leaves than those grown in untreated samples. So what does this mean for future lunar missions? It opens up a world of possibility. The ability to grow food on the moon could drastically reduce the costs and logistical challenges associated with long-term lunar missions. But more than that, it brings us one step closer to the idea of a moon that's not just a barren rock in space, but a place where life can thrive. These findings are just the beginning. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of the moon and its potential for sustaining life, one thing is clear. The future of lunar exploration is looking brighter and greener than ever. So the next time you look up at the moon, don't just see a distant celestial body. See a future garden, a future home, a future filled with possibilities. And remember every new discovery brings us one step closer to that future. So stay curious, stay excited, and most importantly, stay tuned. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more fascinating insights into the world of science. Thank you, and until next time.